Cases of magisterial recount continues for Westmoreland Eastern. It seems like the Jamaica Labour Party's Daniel Lawrence has moved away from the PNP's Luther Buchanan's number of votes and is currently in the lead. There has been a swift turn in the magisterial recount for Westmoreland Eastern. It seems Daniel Lawrence of the Jamaica Labour Party has widened a gap between himself and the People's National Party's Luther Buchanan as the race continues for the Westmoreland Eastern seat. Luther Buchanan has been trailing as Daniel Lawrence leads in the number of votes that has been awarded. The court awarded votes that were previously rejected by the Electoral Office of Jamaica since the first day of the magisterial recount last Friday. It seems that Daniel Lawrence continues to get more of these court awarded votes than Luther Buchanan. Luther Buchanan ended Monday's magisterial recount with 15 of the rejected votes to Lawrence's 26, a lead that could prove ultimately decisive in a parliamentary seat that was deadlocked at the final count before the returning officer's tie-breaking vote. Ten boxes remaining to be counted today during the magisterial recount for Westmoreland Eastern. The attorney for Daniel Lawrence is confident and optimistic that his client will be the victor for the Westmoreland Eastern seat. According to what happened on Monday, he said he is considering that the view is that the numbers are on the JLP side and he feels confident that should the numbers go as they have assessed them, their candidate, Mr. Daniel Lawrence, will be victorious. The attorney for Luther Buchanan has stated that even if the magisterial recount favors Daniel Lawrence, the Jamaica Labour Party candidate would be a placeholder for his client's return to Gordon House. The attorney for Luther Buchanan has said that steps were being undertaken to have the election results of September 3rd voided and that the race should be rerun because of alleged voter irregularities in more than one polling division. According to him, this matter is sure to go to the elections court. As I understand it, someone was taken into custody on Monday for voter impersonation or voting in a polling station where he was not entitled to vote. According to the attorney, this shows that there has been contamination in that polling division and he will be making an application to void that polling division and have a rerun in the Supreme Court. When the Westmoreland police was contacted, they could only confirm that a report has been filed and that an investigation has started into the matter. With only 10 boxes remaining to be counted, the Jamaica Labour Party's Daniel Lawrence has received 2,088 votes to Luther Buchanan's 1,702 votes. The independent candidate Hailey McHale has received 12 votes to the end of the third day of the magisterial recount. From the 107 boxes that have represented 105 polling divisions in the constituency, Daniel Lawrence has 4,543 votes to Buchanan's 4,253 votes. Mikhail has only 30. The magisterial recount was filed by attorneys for the Jamaica Labour Party after Luther Buchanan was declared the winner earlier last week following the returning officer's deciding vote. That vote was to break the tie between both candidates, which stood at 4,834 votes each, after Sunday's official recount. The magisterial recount continues today, September 15th, at 10 a.m., whilst Judge Steve Walters will be continuing that specific recount. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about these new developments that continue to arise as the magisterial recount continues 
for the constituency of Westmoreland Eastern. Now, who do you think will be the victor when it is all over? We are hoping that it will be over today, and it seems that it will be. Now, it seems that Daniel Lawrence of the Jamaica Labour Party is currently in the lead, as he has picked up more votes from those votes that were rejected by the Electoral Office of Jamaica. Now, of course, there are other issues that have arisen. The attorneys for the PNP's candidate, Luther Buchanan, is planning to file a motion in the Supreme Court in regards to electoral irregularities in one specific polling division in Westmoreland Eastern. Thanks for watching.